The South African Reserve Bank is likely to reduce interest rates in September, potentially benefiting various asset classes. Following the July meeting, where the repo rate was maintained at 8.25%, experts from Bank of America, Nedbank, Standard Bank, Investec and the Bureau for Economic Research anticipate a 25 basis points rate cut next month. Moreover, as interest rates decline, investors show more interest in bonds offering higher rates than the market average, leading to increased prices. Efficient Wealth notes that investors are monitoring the potential effects of local rate cuts on their portfolios. Economics professor Walter Krichel provides insights on this development. All of us are hopeful of a repo rate cut in September. The expected 25 basis points cut will not be a lot, but it will provide relief in many households' budgets. The opposite side of the coin is that interest rates on savings will now be lower. The money market and fixed deposits have provided good returns in the past two years, but this will drop along with the repo rate. It raises the question of where to put your savings. Traditionally, stocks and bonds do better when interest rates trend lower. But it's useful to talk to your financial advisor. One way to get exposure to the stock market may be an exchange-traded fund. Get some advice from a professional.